Hello, welcome, welcome back to Just One Look, and today we're having a look at the Shadow of the Beast on the Atari ST. So this was, of course, released first on the Amiga, and was, um, yeah, apparently too much for any other system to cope with, and they couldn't possibly convert it. But of course, that was rubbish. While it may not look as good, well, it certainly doesn't look as good on any other system. I don't know, perhaps the Mega Drive looked pretty similar to the Amiga version, I don't know. But, um... Gameplay wise, yeah, the 8 bits certainly could um, replicate it quite easy, easily. Even earlier systems could probably replicate it because it's really quite underwhelming. So, we're the beast, we can punch, and we can do a flying kick, and that's it. There are things you can pick up, I believe. Think sort of weapons you can pick up. Now, there's going to be a boulder appear out of nowhere, no warning, there's nothing to say there's something throwing a boulder, but it's going to appear. There we are. Punch! Now, as you can see, this isn't the best version. Actually, for the Atari was capable of a lot better, and I think there's actually a, there was a demo made of a version of it, which was far, far better than this official version. So you can see the sprites colour is a mouldy green and every, everything uh, blends in quite a bit on this level. Not so bad on the next level, but it's very underwhelming. Let's go in here. So of course there's not even any music. Inside a winding staircase, yep, you know. Okay, so we're on the next bit. Now that thing's going to fire a fireball, but it doesn't actually fire it because it's in a different place. So there is a ladder there. It's quite oh, hard to tell it's a ladder. So we've got something here, we're going to punch. So it took me a while to work out that was actually a ladder. That's more like Spectrum gra graphics to be honest. Ow! Oh. Okay. Well, I'm not sure exactly how you meant to deal with those. Can I? I can do a flying jump at an angle. Okay, down this ladder. So I have found out if you go another way, you go straight along here, you get trapped behind a boss. You can't get by without uh, picking up a weapon. So that's a bit, a bit rubbish. Let's go down here. Okay. So I'm pretty sure there's something we've got to collect before we go. Okay. Brilliant. Okay, let's have one more go. Okay, let's go the other way a little bit this time. Cause it's so much fun. Oh, ah, dear. So they move so fast you can barely react to them. These are all right. Okay, but then you get these spikes coming up, up out of the ground. No warning. You can't see where they're going to come up. They just appear. That's yeah, a lot of bad design in this game. I assume it was similar on the Amiga in that respect, but I don't know for sure. Okay, let's head back this way. Run, 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 hope we don't die. It's very exciting. Oh, totally mistimed that. Oh dear, I think I'm going to die before I get very far. I have to say, I don't really care. Let it finish! Oh, jump over that, no. There we go. I'll just show you what happens actually if we go the other way, if I survive. Okay. Phew, missed that. So go, got jump over here. So I mean, da da da. Oh, let's go this way. This looks fine. 
Why wouldn't I? Down here. Oh, there's a ladder here, actually. Hmm. See, look at that graphic. That's t there. Terrible. You get to go down a bit, and then you can see it's a ladder. Go up here. There's nothing. So what can happen? You can go along here, then all of a sudden, all of a sudden, we're blocked. Oh no! Can't get by. And there's this. Now, first two times I came down here, that actually moved towards me this way. The last two times, it's just just stayed there. But without um, the weapon or something you need, if you need some sort of ranged attack, you can't do anything, as far as I can tell. Is there any ladders? Have I missed something? Because as soon as I touch it, I die. So you're just stuck here. So, mm, great. Great design. I mean, I could be wrong. Perhaps I'm missing something, but... I think I just want to end it. So this is quite a inferior version of a very lacklustre game, as far as gameplay is concerned anyway. But this version is just pretty bad, I have to say. So let me just finish it, there we go. So I don't know, perhaps I was doing something wrong, perhaps I missed something, but on the whole it seems a really, really bad game. So anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time.